Hey yo, what is up legends and welcome back to High Q Day. Bro, it is at least 40,000 degrees Celsius in Australia right now. If you hear this fan, listen. I have to have a fan on because I have a ring light on and it's so hot and I'm just here sweating, all right? So I'm sorry if the audio is a little bit whack. We're just gonna have to deal with it. I'm very excited to get into this episode because I feel like we're etching closer and closer to nationals now. The last episode, we kind of wrapped up the last of the date tech arc. My brain had an absolute stroke trying to pronounce their setter's name, but it was really cool all around how we saw it was a very sneaky, a very well done way of showing us some more progression. Like, we obviously had Hinata's training arc there, and then Kageyama went to the training camp as well. But then it was very clever how they actually showed the progression through like the conflict that they had and how now the resolution coming out, you know, Kageyama being more strict, more demanding of his teammates. We saw Asahi there trying out a new move, a new hit. So I'm very eager to see it all come together as a team as we go to nationals now. I hope you legends have had the most amazing day ever. Whatever you did today, I am super, super proud of you. And I know you gave it your best. And that is always all that matters. So I think without any further ado, let's get into this next Haikyuu reaction. Haikyuu day. Also, you know, she should be like, Lachlan, I know the audio is a little bit whack, but like your backdrop looks a little bit different to usual. A little bit more boring. Yeah, that's because the red lights aren't on. Because I broke them again, dog. Those who have been here since the start know we've gone through two sets of lights now. And they are not cheap. Dog, I don't know why they're so expensive in Australia, but getting lights, I, I tripped on the cord and broke them. The new ones are on the goddamn way. Let's start. <laughs> now I'm triggered. Let's start this episode. Sawamaru. Look, that's not how you say it. Yep. Well, Daddy Daichi is here and I'm happy. He's got a barking dog thing. Is his alarm? Hello? You comfy? Oh, we are close. Whoa, this looks way different. Huh? Oh, is he having an... Okay, for a second I thought I'd accidentally started a wrong episode. He's dreaming, right? This isn't real. Is Caitlin Clark there? To be honest, this is my worst nightmare as well. Except there would be crocodiles there. I don't know why, but I've recently like developed a fear of crocodiles. I've never seen one. I hope I never will. And they are in Australia. We have big suckers here, as Steve Irwin would capture. But I've just been recently really scared of them. They're, re they're essentially just dinosaurs that are alive now. So mine would be going to play volleyball. There's basketball being played, and there's a crocodile there on two legs. Just there like, doo -doo, doo -doo, dunks on me, and then eats me. Whew! I gotta take a break now, I'm fear sweating. And I'm afraid of spiders. I shouldn't live in Australia, man. I'm so, I'm taking away from this. Poor Daichi, man. He's having nightmares that he's the only one on the team. That's horrible. Why are they showing me this? Make me sad with Dai. Is he gonna die? Oh, Oh, it's a new year. That is the worst way. To... If I had a nightmare on like the changing over of the years, I'd be so upset. Even though I hate like everyone's night. Like waiting to the end of the year and thinking it's gonna mean good things. Who's he meeting? The art style's different, but I actually kind of fuck with it. Oh wait, they all got there early. So they're who's meeting up? I don't know, what do they do in Japan on New Year's? <laughs> Shimizu! The go! <laughs> Look, they were all trying to get here early, but they're all the same. They're so funny. Is it just the third year's meeting up? Oh. All of them. Oh no, this is so nice. I definitely... 
I'm kind of surprised that like Shimizu's here with them. I know, I know like that those three are friends and that she's like there and sh like everyone really loves her and she is really good for them. I didn't know they were all so close knit, all of these guys here. This is really nice. Like I would have thought she would have had her own friends, right? Her own friend group and stuff. I feel like I still don't know that much about her. Ah, uh, those had to make me cry. Holy fuck. All right. Other than that, I love her and she's the best. <laughs> so this is nice. <laughs> Why is everyone so quiet? Look at Asahi, man. He looks like he's about to throw up. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah. They go somewhere to pray? They line up to pray. Oh. A fortune. It's like a fortune cookie. Curse luck. I don't know what that means. Oh, okay. Right. I like fortune cookies because the fortune cookies taste yummy. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I like to be thankful all the time for everyday things. Oh. <laughs> Shimizu is so stylish, man. Oh, I also good out for the old dog next to what? That's so sweet. Damn, that's cold. Damn, the only one who can tell them off. Because <laughs> no one can tell off Shimizu. Mm, there you go. She knew what she was saying. <laughs> the sun shining on her like an angel. Mm. And the guitar, the music's so good. I love them all. They're so great. Hagiyama out on a run. I like his kit, man. That's sick. I have skins like that. Go on a New Year's Shrine visit with Yamaguchi for certain victory you want to come, Hinata. No. <laughs> I kind of fuck with it though. I like that, you know, I feel like so many people, even though Hinata just wants to hang out, so many people, if they didn't want to go, it's to be like, yeah, I'll come. But I just love that Kogiyama says exactly what he means no matter what, because it means when he gives a compliment that it's true. I love that Hinata throws the phone. <laughs> she didn't write me a Happy New Year's letter. Oh, look what... Who is that? W look what everyone's doing. His big bro's drinking. But he left him alone. That's kind of nice. Hmm. That was really nice. Well, he's got to go and check that volleyball still exists at his school. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Hmm? Oh look, what are they playing? It looks like badminton. But different, that's a different sound to badminton. Are they, are they just allowed to go to the school? Like tuna. Oh, okay. That's so funny. Yeah, if they get sick, an hour would be the worst time. <laughs> He's such a dad, man. I absolutely love it. I also like his sweater. Gotta be that sweater. Ah, oh, what? Is this the dude from his team from junior high? 
I think it is. Like, the art style is kind of different. I can't think who else it would be. This is so nice that they can still, like, chat and catch up. あの白鳥沢破って全国行くってだけですげえことだ。うん。ああ、that's <笑> <laughs> it is him! Okay. Well, we have a lot of people depending on us, yeah. Which you can either take as pressure, but I take that as so much like... What a reason to push forward. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. However, I'm like nervous for them. Everyone's packing to go away. That's so cool. Bye, Hinata's little sister. I forgot your name. Are we at halftime already? They come a little bit earlier. Yeah, you know what that means, fam? Water up. Hydration. No energy drinks and no Coca Cola, dog. Water and feed your brain. Also, I feel like I have to say, oh, was it two episodes ago now? Two or one? When I was doing, those of you who watched and saw the little bit I said at the end, and I was like, and that person <laughs> that commented that he nearly dropped the show during the Bull Boy arc, and I was like, you're the reason Vinland Saga didn't do as well, and I was hating on it, bro. That poor, people were agreeing with me in the comments. <laughs> and that guy commented and he's like, damn, bro, I remember commenting that. I'm sorry, fam. I was just trying to share my thoughts. <laughs> and I felt so, because he's commented several times. It was always super, super nice. And I just absolutely shredded him. It was all done in light heart, all right? I just get way too passionate about things way too quickly, which you guys know. And I just felt like I had to say sorry. And that, I still really appreciate you being, he still watched the video, regardless. I still really appreciate you. Uh, yep, just wanted to say that as well. The sky tree. I've seen one like that in China when I went to China. And it's got like, it lights up at night. I like that Suki's sleeping. They're warm, okay. Saying the Nekama coach organized it? <laughs> I love so much just the hold the dice he has on everyone. How much they respect him. The trip would be one of the best bits, and Hinata didn't throw up. Oh shit, we're saying at uh, four, what's it, Four Seasons? Five Seasons Hotel? Who wants to go to Four Seasons Hotel? I do, mother. Oh, never mind. That's still fine. Hell yeah. I wouldn't care where we're staying. Not... Yeah, I was gonna say, not quiet at all. You're supposed to be chill. <laughs> Bro. How cool is this? They were able to organize a place to warm up down there? That's, like, for me, that's gonna be unheard of. Alright, RT, have your freak out. Oh, actually, yeah, probably. Poor Yachi. Just remember to breathe. I'd be so nervous, bro. The first game's gonna be mayhem, I know it. This is why he treat. Wait, what? I treated him to beers. Has he organized something? Ah, oh, okay. I should have just waited. Oh, but we will be. I want to see that. Electronic shops. I'm awesome video. Wait, what? That guy, this is like my mic'd up videos, but way better. 
His friend made this. Oh! Yeah, how'd they get these camera angles? Are they breaking the fourth wall right here? They even got text edit over it. My theme song would be um, that Indian rapper. You know, it's like that. Oh, what's it called? Is it Big Dogs? Hang on, let me look. Big Dogs! Big Dogs! You know, it's like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And then I don't I don't remember that. It goes, dun -na -dun -na, dun -na -dun -na. I'm a big stepper. And like the beat. That would be my bit, alright? As I do something cool, play a cool clip, Lachlan, of me doing something. Oh, when they get nicknames? Hell yeah. This will help. Yeah, calm them down. That's so cool. Mm. They have so many people supporting them. It's so good. Yeah, Noshita can lock it down. Suga, you're not going to lock it down. Exactly, you're going to encourage them. <laughs> he doesn't deny it though. Daichi knows. Huh? You were just going to go out without telling anyone? Just in a random city? That's crazy. What if they get lost? <laughs> nope, not happening. Not happening. He knew straight away. They're giving him a cute little bike with a basket on it. This is so funny, these three going out. These three, so. Ah, uh, he's going to love this. Getting to be in charge of them. Hmm. I don't know if Yamaguchi would be... He doesn't jog that much. Mm. Studying? Hell yeah, respect. Yeah, they're going to have a is that Tanaka or Naruto? Naruto. Oh. Be respectful. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright. Careful. Whoa. Alright. Let's be careful here, please. Why don't... I'm really warm right now, Yachi. A lot of scars. She covered them up? Oh, she had hurdles? Ouch. Oh, they have hurdles? I always think you should... Yeah, holy fuck, Yachi just took the words out of my mouth. I was about to say, I don't think you should ever cover those things up. Look, can you see this? You can't really see it in the light here. But like along there, and I have them like across my back. It, they're stretch marks, okay? I have them in my arm. But they're stretch marks from growing muscles so quickly. I know that sounds arrogant as fuck, but I was fucking, I used to be a skinny little fuck. I was very skinny and I put on muscle very quick. 
but my body couldn't keep up with it, so I have stretch marks across parts of my body. And I know my brother has them, and he's really self-conscious about them, and I just don't give a fuck, man. I say they're like stripes of a tiger, and tigers are one of the most biggest, baddest fucking predators in the fucking animal kingdom, and tigers have to earn their stripes in order to be cool. So to have something like that, you had to go through something pretty tough to achieve something really cool. So your scars, your stripes, you have to earn them, and you should wear them with pride, always. I never cover them up. I think it's super cool. Okay. And like athletics are such a solo sport as well. I'm pretty sure it's a Japanese thing that everyone is fine bathing naked around each other, right? Definitely not an Australian thing. <laughs> you go straight to prison for that when I try and sneak in other people's showers. Cut that bit. <laughs> this is a very wholesome episode. There, I know some people go, it's a filler episode. I fuck with this shit. I love these episodes. Damn! Oh my god, I'm, I'm actually like nervous. In my chest is tight. Oh,まあ、グンスクロールテームス。ストー。あ、ガールズテームスアズウェル。でん、でも、マスキュラー。that's not what he meant。雰囲気、雰囲気が大事なんだから。そう、あ、the well, you could probably start. I... It's hard to see other people living your dream. Getting picked up like that and carried around. <laughs> That's an absolute horrible joke. <laughs> that is rough, man. Haven't heard me now to like... Uppies! Uppies! <laughs> That's rough, man. I'd be screaming and crying by now. Kanoka. Okay, that's cool. Ah, he hasn't seen her since fourth grade? Huge is a bad word to use in that sense. Even though he meant it as a compliment. Oh, he's realized. Uh -huh. <laughs> Somebody help him! Somebody help him! Hey, it's the not in the way, Libro. Sinkagiyama talks to someone. Is he going to eye him down? Mm, I really want to see him play. Number, number two? Okay, that doesn't surprise me at all. <gasps> yes! Ah, oh, it's so good to see them again. Number one pupil. Look, everyone's like iron him off. Oh, and everyone's hearing him say he's his pupil. Wait, what did he just say? I'm not going to go easy on you. Yeah, God. There's so many teams I want to see us play. Zuki! <laughs> Zuki! 
<laughs> oh, that's so funny, man. I love it so much. <gasps> Damn, look. Oh, what's his name? The guy who, the middle blocker on the left there, who's like waving. Um, who was like the first one to stop the quick. Okay, oh, fuck. He was so, he was basically oh, no, Hinata. I forgot. He was so cool. <laughs> oh, no, no, Yo, this is so good. <laughs> yes, he's just hiding it. I love this banter. <laughs> this is so good. But Karasuno would have to have like an, like a, um, a reputation in there, right? Being like the ones who beat Shuratori Zawa, because everyone would know who Ushiwaka is. Fuck, I did it again, Ushijima. Oh shit, this is like the Olympics, man. Oh damn, you tell him, you tell him. Yo, I'm, I'm so nervous watching this. He definitely does. No, oh, this is so great. Holy shit, I can't believe we're here. Yeah. Look at him. Holy shit, we've come so far. Remember when we just started watching this and I had 50 subscribers on YouTube? And these, this little boy was playing his first ever comp? Holy shit. Yo, this is sick. Look at all those teams. Can I see where Bokuto's team is? I wonder if they went into that much detail. That might be them there on the left. There's no way I can zoom this in for y'all to see. No, I don't know. Mm, you know what? It's about to end. That's the only time ever I've been okay with it ending there. No cliffhanger. That was a fantastic episode. It was... I know... I don't know what the word like the actual way to name it because I know some people be like filler episode but these some of these episodes are like my favorite when they have it there and they have like just showing the different relationship buildings and like just the essence of like them being like just high school boys in there right like being super excited to be at the inn wanting to run around and explore and then having the the highlight video for them and then getting to the comp being nervous seeing all their friends around Tanaka seeing his old friend the girl there um, was just so cool. I love these episodes where they like just build out on them being actual high school boys. I feel like that one went by so fast. Just, I really enjoyed it. And those ones always seem to go the fastest. Um, Daichi seeing his friend there at the start and getting to talk to him and seeing that like, you know, there's so many people that are like counting on them to do well, um, which is really, really cool. Seeing the third years go together to do their thankful prayer. I think, yeah, the New Year's prayer. And then Shimizu and Yachi like in the bath talking and sharing that moment there. It was just really everything. They covered everyone there and it was just really nice. I love these little like character building bits that they have and just making it seem like so much more real, right? Because we have been there since the start and now to see them get to this stage and like how much things have changed all around the relationships as well as their play style. It's just really, really cool to be able to see all of it, all of it, there together. But just like in Haikyuu, it takes over four seasons, well, three, and now we're, what, three and a half seasons to achieve something great, to do something cool, right? And in real life, it takes a long time to do anything great. So if you have started something new or you're working on a project or you're studying or you're going away, whatever it is, it does take a long time to achieve something great. So maybe you're failing at the moment, but remember those failures always make up when you get that one that goes through and then it looks like you've done it overnight, right? So keep sticking at it because I do really want to hear about the great things you achieve. So I hope you legends have the most amazing rest of your day and I will see you all in the next reaction. All right, legends, peace. Oh,